Hello, I'm Archie Luxury, and welcome to the program Fuckeries! Hello, fuckers! And today, I'd like to have a look at an eBay listing. This is an eBay listing for a vintage 18 karat gold Patek Philippe 3596. And uh, this is a piece that a, a viewer has asked me, what's my opinion on it? And uh, let's just have a look at the, the uh, description there. 18K yellow gold Patek reference 3969, 3569. This watch belonged to my father and I don't know much about it. It has been sitting in a drawer for many years. It doesn't have a strap. The watch works and keeps good time. The watch measures 35mm without the lugs. The watch is sold as is. Blah, blah, blah. Now, what's interesting here is he's trying to come off as a complete novice. The watch belonged to my father and I don't know much about it. Yet, he's got professional photos of the piece. I mean, this is not fucking amateur hour photos. These are... These are um, these are really well done photos. And you can see a little bit of uh, water damage on the dial. See around at the uh, 8 position. Bit of water damage between the 7 and 8 position there. And also, I don't know if that's a, uh, I don't know if that's damage to the dial. About the 3 to 4 position. That could just be the glass or crystal. It's probably a plastic glass on this vintage piece. But um, he's also got a picture of the movement. And, uh, I mean, that, that's not an easy pick to get. How, how, how would he get that pick? You know, that's, that's a little bit discerning. It's, uh, it's a really, it's quite a nice, it's a quite a nice Patek. But it just, I just get a bit worried. Look at this, he's got the whole fucking thing pulled apart. And, uh, you know, it's just, it's just funny. He, he's saying he's a novice and this and that. I, I think he's had it looked at and it may need to fix the dial. Fuck. That's a very, very hard thing to do. I don't think you can easily fix that. But uh, what I like to do is, okay, let, let, let's, let's do, okay, so you've got the details of the watch. Let's search for that reference. Protect 3569, just to see what are they they come up with on um, on the flea. You've got some Christie's auctions here. That, that, that could be interesting for a look. Uh, we've also got, let's look at images, Google images of this piece here. Yeah, that looks about right. Yep. Okay, so there was an there was integrated bracelet version as well as a strap version. It's a nice blue dial there. Let's have a look here. What do we what do we got here? You can you can it's really good to have a look to make sure it's basically look it, it looks basically kosher. The only the only down is the dial itself is is down. And uh, here we go. This was a white gold one that's a bit more desirable. It's a slash one, which means it had the integrated gold bracelet. Yeah, okay, so the, the, the pricing, circa 1975, 35 mil size, that's, uh, okay, okay, so just, just doing a bit of checks on the flea, we can see that we've checked that reference number, and it looks, it looks basically right, that model reference does exist, and, um, it's, it seems, it seems, it seems okay there, look, my, my concern is this, so, so it ended up going for, 5.8 US, okay, so 6 grand shipped, um, my concern is that that dial, that, that, that is my big concern, it's got the, the damage, the damage to the dial there, that's, that would be my concern there, I'd be a bit worried about that, and uh, that's not easy to fix, because you send it to protect, they want to replace the dial, they want to service it, they'll, they'll, they'll give you a, uh, a second asshole. So it's a bit of a tricky one. It's not in terrible condition. I, I think you could get that dial fixed up, but far out, you're not really paying a cheap price on it. It's still, you're paying a, a premium. We don't really know what condition the movement's in. I mean, it's running, but it, that doesn't mean it's great. The hands look like they could be, you know, I'd probably want to replace them. They've got a bit of 
if a bit of water's gone in, they, they, they get a bit funny, so maybe they need replacing. I think it's high money for a not a perfect watch. I'd, I'd give it, I'd give it the, um, I'd walk away personally, but uh, there you go. That's Archie's advice there. I'm Archie Luxury. Tell me what you fuckers think of that.